Uh, come on. What? Why would you die? Die. Oh, I think he died. Did he die? There's a little guy. Oh, wait. Yeah, there were parts over there. Kind of like a crab dab. <laughs>What's up guys and welcome back to Gorn and for today's episode we're gonna take a look at what is quite possibly the most complex mod for this game yet. The Magic Tomes mod should not only give me magic powers but also the ability to enchant my weapons so that they have magic powers which sounds nuts. Thank you for coming out today gentlemen I really appreciate it I always need new volunteers because the old ones don't last all that long, but just a second, okay? I just need to figure myself out. So I'm pretty sure we have fire, earth, water, and air? I, I mean air. We definitely have fire, earth, water, and air, okay? If you haven't seen my playthrough of Waltz of the Wizard, you might not know, but I am one of the best VR wizards in the world, so I'm more than capable of picking up a silly little magic tome and then waving my hand, making the weapons and the fence disappear. You see? Magic. And then... Uh, reading this, I suppose? Whoa, oh, oh. That was intentional, okay? You saw nothing. That That's definitely fire, all right? So I can... Oh. Oh, hold on, hold on. Whoa, whoa, whoa. What? Are you kidding me? Oh, okay, hold on, hold on. I'm a wizard, not a baseball player. Just, just give me a second. This is crazy. Like, we've never seen something like this in a mod. We've seen people bring stuff over, like new weapons and things like that, but this is just a completely different mechanic. We've never thrown elemental fire, little fireballs, there we go. Oh, I'm gonna have way too much fun with this. You guys are made of candy, right? Do you think any part of you is made of a s'more? Is that asking too much? I know your nipples are made out of bubble gum. I, I don't think roasting those is gonna be quite the same. <laughs> He's just a pile of limbs. Holy crap, okay. This does not seem all that fair. <laughs> I was kind of hoping they would burst into flames, but that might be asking a, a little bit too much. Every time I summon a fireball, I'm tempted to just lean off and give it a full baseball throw, but then I hit my ceiling fan, and it's much easier for me to just do little beer pong throws. <laughs> like, it's still, it's still gonna do that. Or it doesn't matter how hard you throw a fireball, it's a fireball. What do you want? Oh, I am gonna boil you alive in there. Just you, just you wait as soon as I, as soon as I, oh, there it is, there it is. Oh, hold on, just careful. That's the stuff. <laughs> Was he running on rocket fuel? How does that work? I know this isn't quite a fist, but I'm really curious what happens if I punch you with it. That's what happens. I tried to block the hammer with the book. It didn't work all that well. Go figure. I should probably just stick to... I don't know if the fire has anything to do with that. I just think I'm hitting them with a crazy kind of tiger fang fist sort of move. <laughs> just uh, slow it down real quick. Maybe, oh my god, I actually did block that with the book. They really don't make books like, ah, they used to. Uh, uh, it's in my side. <laughs> oh, rude. Oh, oh, that one's in my face. Oh, uh, okay, rude boy. I really... How does it stick in me, but it just kind of go, what is this? Oh, this is bogus. You could just suck it and suck it and suck it. Overall, I would say I'm quite impressed with the fire book, but there's still more that we can do with this. I know that you simple paper mache oompa loompas would have a hard time understanding this, but as the greatest VR wizard in the world, I don't need to read the magic tome itself. All I need to do is read the developer's notes on the mod to understand that we could do more than simply cast magical spells. We can also use the Enchantatron 2000 <laughs> to enchant our weapons. Now this is a new model, so I'm not entirely sure how it works. I had the 1000 for a very long time. Pretty sure we just pop the tome in there. Yeah, there we go. Okay, and then we grab our weapon or weapons of choice, and then we should be able to enchant them. Whoa. 
I'm just checking real quick to see if it kind of slashes out fire or shoots anything. It doesn't seem so. Maybe they'll explode into flames when I hit them. We'll also get our flaming hammer. That is a really cool effect. <laughs> okay, you know what? I'm ready. I don't think these guys are ready. No one could be ready for my fiery, rubbery vengeance. Now, for one of a wizard's favorite questions, will this make you burst into flames? Apparently not. I'm not even sure if it cauterizes the wound. <laughs> because you still got candy flying all over the place, so even that might be wishful thinking. Okay, I wasn't sure how the effect would work with this, but I do know how they work. And it's actually really clever, because like I said, the fireballs are uh, a little overpowered, it seems. <laughs> You kind of just automatically win with them, whereas these are, are quite a bit more balanced. These feel like a part of the game. The way that it works is against flesh, you do incredibly high damage, but against armor, it doesn't do anything extra. So I pretty much just need to touch their little paper mache butts and they should explode. Damn it, I stabbed this guy in the chest and I didn't even use the great pun of do you feel any heartburn? Heartburn? Heartburn, there it is, you see, heartburn, you, oh god, don't, don't pity smile at me, I don't need this. So since I do increase damage, can I chop you right down the middle? I do so, crap, I do so much damage that they kind of just go flying across the arena. <laughs> and I can't see my end work, but I'm trying to chop them right down the middle of the head. I want to get like two even halves. How about you? Can I get to your head? Just got to use the can opener real quick. This is a lot more damage. It's not like the freaking Mjolnir that I did last episode where I cranked it up by 10 and was hitting people so hard their limbs would explode before they got sent out of the arena, but it's still a balanced amount of additional damage. I don't think a fire hammer works. I don't think, ow, I don't think I can hurt armor. Which is uh, a problem when you're surrounded by guys with armor. I don't, I don't seem to be hurting any armor with this thing. Ah, oh, crap. Okay, I need, to, I need to go for the stabbies. Gotta go for the stabbies. Come on. Oh, this is just not gonna work. Hmm. I don't think that's really working as intended. I think it's supposed to be that fire has no bonus against armor because you're not touching the flesh, as opposed to fire can't hurt armor because a fiery hammer and a regular hammer should do the exact same thing. But anyway, I want to move on to... Ooh, I'm not sure. Do I want to try out some champions? Or do I want to try a challenge? Because then I can choose whatever weapon I want and I can upgrade that. And... I kind of want to throw fireballs at champions. That's just too good to resist. Ugh, a spiky ball and a chain. How archaic! I don't need anything like that. I'm more than ready with the power of fire. Hopefully, the fact that you're covered in armor won't... Oh, crap. I never even thought this through. <gasps> please work on armor, please. Work on armor. There you go. You just got to throw pleases into your spells, right? Thank thank you. We appreciate you. Alley -oop. Oh, oh, it goes right through the gong. Come on. I can't even hit the king or anything like that. That's lame. At some point, somebody is going to create a mod where you can murder the king, and it is going to be the biggest thing in this game. Did I say a spiky ball on a chain was archaic? Because I meant a spiky ball on a stick. Oh, right! He's the one that likes to make the dramatic WWE wrestler's entrance. <laughs> Come on, let's get this show on the road, okay? These fireballs aren't going to summon themselves. Come on. Come on, any, any, can I help him through there, I wonder? It's really hard to throw these. <laughs> it's like trying to throw a dart with your pinky finger. There we go. Okay, so, have you been fixed at all lately? No, he is still gonna do -si do and be target practice. Sounds good to me. Uh, whoop, a little high. Whoop, there we go. <laughs> Accuracy isn't my strong suit, but I, I make the ones that land count. So, sorry, sorry. Great. Here I am saying that accuracy isn't my strong suit, and now I have to hit his tiny little atrophied leg. <laughs> they skip leg day on purpose, okay? It's strategy. How am I going to hit that from here? Maybe I could just kind of rapid fire? Oh, yeah, apparently hitting him in the head, even if it won't go through his helmet, does quite a bit of damage. 
<laughs> yeah, let's just rapid fire. You know what? Why don't we just make it hail fire? See how you handle that? Probably not all too well. I'm gonna send you back to your little garage. It... It just blew him up. Wait, what? I thought his armor was impregnable. I just kind of detonated. Oh, yeah. Apparently, these things are a lot stronger than I thought. Oh, come on. Really? Like, if the Herculean armor couldn't stand up to my fireballs, what chance does Bobby Bearnips over here have? Okay, you know, fine. I'll do it for the crowd. I'm not sure how I'm going to make this interesting, but I'll find a way. No, I, I meant that you don't have anything covering your nips, not that you have nips that look like they come from a bear. <laughs> uh, maybe I could just give you a fiery punch. Would that be a thing? Just please don't, you know, stab my heart. My heart really doesn't appreciate that. Okay, there we go. A little heartburn for it. Whoa, whoa, I think I broke his spine. No, just a temporary melt. It's good. Uh, let's see here. Uh-huh, uh-huh. My book says you can, uh, go away. Oh, oh crap, he kind of hurt me there. A little, little bit. O only a little bit. Just a touch. Really is amazing what a fireball can do to the human body. <laughs> I mean, if you call that human. Oh, this is gonna be stupid, isn't it? Because you're gonna have all your archery friends come out, and I'm gonna have to try to block arrows with the book. Oh, it does say fire on it. I didn't realize they were labeled. I, I mean, I was well aware that they're labeled because I'm a master wizard. Okay, don't question me. I'm gonna come over there and give you the salt and pepper treatment. Okay, I don't care about your little peons. They can come out right behind you and make my life difficult all they want. Uh, maybe, maybe I could be an agile wizard, a nimble wizard, and then a uh, little, little, whoa, 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 salt and pepper, salt and pepper. Just, just a little bit raining down on you. Hold on, hold on. Fireballs for everybody. I just want to drop them on his head, but he's making it really difficult. You stop stop running from me. There you go. You can go away and a uh, little bit of this. There we go. You see? The salt and pepper attack. <laughs> this might be my strongest attack in this game, honestly. It just kind of rains down hellfire. Oh, you're out of arrows. I never even thought about that happening. Whoa, whoa. Okay, rude. Salt and pepper. Salt and pepper. There you go. <laughs> yeah, it, uh... It gets the job done. Man, that is just graphically pleasing. Really quickly, to the people at home watching, I don't know how your day is going, but when I woke up this morning, I didn't say to myself, I'm gonna find out what happens when you throw a fireball at a virtual badger. Yet here we are, and it's gonna happen. And hopefully, I'm even gonna hit him. But, uh, no promises. These badgers are wily. Willing to bet that old Brady is gonna go after your foot again, isn't he? Hold, hold on, just, just wait for it. Wait for it. Oh, look at that. Maybe not. Uh, hey, 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 Stop that, stop that. You, you, that's right, you run back after him. They, they made a run for it there for a second. Oh, right, I forgot how panicking these things are when they just kind of launch at your, at your head. Stop it, okay? You guys really just aren't afraid of fire? How are you not afraid of fire? Everything's afraid of fire. What about a fiery uppercut? Is that the kind of thing that you're into? Not quite? Okay, can you please just call them off? Okay, that's your only warning. You are no longer Badger Man. You are just... Man, where'd the other one go? I guess he was afraid of fire. Are... Is he eating my butt right now? I think he's eating my butt right now. Uh, hold on. Uh, there, there he is. Oh, 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 he's still he's still eating my butt from the front. Stop that. Here, you, you go over there. Eat him. Can you please eat him? Can I actually do that, I wonder? <laughs> please, get off. Off. Oh, Dear God, that's nightmare fuel. Off, off, thank you, good boy. I just wanna make him eat your face. No, no, come here, come here. You got a delicious little face. Oh, no, no, you can't convince me otherwise. Look at that mustache, just um, nom, 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 nom. Hold on, hold on, oh my God. It actually works. Why have I never thought of that before? And now I don't even really need to do anything, right? He's gonna latch on and, and go to, I'll put him out of his misery, how about that? We'll just, there you go. Better to go by fireball than by pet mauling. Please get off my face. You going to kill your little friend again? I, I can't, it's to the point where I can call it. 
I don't know why you guys are arguing. I, can I get you, like, couples counseling or, or something like that? Okay, even a wizard can't solve any problem. Okay, no, it's fine. It's fine. Okay, yeah, I'll, I'll take care of the big one, and then maybe I'll come back and, and try for a little one. No rush. Crap, why does that keep happening? Hey, can't be embarrassing myself in front of the giant. I keep forgetting how freaking big you actually are. Yeah, those fireballs really freaking hurt. Just hit him, whoa, it's square in the chest and he goes flying. Maybe I can, uh, Kobe, air it is. <laughs> oh yeah, that is just really, really overpowered. Even three fireballs is making somebody's torso explode. Feels kinda nuts. Speaking of nuts. Wow. This guy had balls of steel. Oh, no, there they go. Can we try that again without you killing your little friend? Okay, thank you very much. I was gonna say, I kinda want to see if I can hit him off his shoulder. I gotta improve my accuracy somehow, okay? And this is the best way. I don't know why I keep like doing this as if I need to be Doctor Strange being all dramatic, summoning a fireball. I'm just, I'm so into it. Damn, okay, yeah, calm down up there. Oh, uh, whoops, swing and a miss. Swing and a miss. Oh, I got him there. I, oh, stop it, stop it, stop it. Ah, come on, come on, watch out, crowd. I'm just nailing people in the crowd in the face. Yeah, I got him. Okay, now we can take care of the big guy. Just, you, you go away. I, I gotta, oh, no, I gotta kill you. I gotta kill you so that I don't die. There we go. Okay, so, ow. Did you just hit me with an arrow? How dare you? Holy crap! <laughs> the big guys explode a little bit, but the little guys explode a lot! Well, apparently, if I want to face off against the last champion and get myself some boiled lobster, I need to dispose of you dummies first, which is fine, because I want to try something. What would happen if I enchanted a rock? Can I make a fire rock? <laughs> would that be good? Because I, I really want to hit you guys with a fire rock. Just gonna pop you in the old Chantatron 2000, and yep. That's a fire rock, all right. Can I have that back, I wonder? I can. Okay, good. So now I can screw around with fireballs and fire rocks. <laughs> I mean, there's so many other weapons to try, but in reality, I, I get the feeling they're just gonna be the same, right? It's just additional damage. Maybe some of the really, really big weapons I'll try. Like if I get my hands on something like that. Our version of that might be kind of fun. Stay back! I have a glowing rock! You have no idea the powers that lay within this! It can just separate your head from your body, apparently. <laughs> this is so powerful! Even the rock, the weakest weapon in the game, just completely destroys people with the fire ability. That's super useful. I wonder what happened if I threw it at somebody. There's no way this would kill someone. I get the feeling it's just gonna bounce off his head and he's gonna look at me like, ow, who, who throws a rock? No, never mind. he can't look at me because uh, there's, there's not much left of him. Don't make me fireball jerk on you. Uh... <laughs> I sometimes wonder if I'm 12 years old. <laughs> Oh, yeah, that, that's definitely how I wanted to spend my morning. Just jerking fireballs out. There we go. When you're standing behind the big fancy door, do you think to yourself, maybe the shield isn't gonna work all that well against the wizard. Maybe I should try something else, like going home to my stupid paper mache gladiator family. The women in this species must be absolutely terrifying. Maybe they're inversed, right? They have little tiny bodies and gigantic legs. We'll never... Did somebody get on that, okay? Make a mod of Gorn women. I need that in my life. In all reality, you could just put a wig on these guys. They got giant titties. It wouldn't be so... bad. Listen, I know that you probably don't care, but I had to end, like, six bloodlines to get to you, so you had better be... delicious, to say the least. I get the feeling fireballs are gonna be a little overpowered here, right? Anything ranged against the crab, because his strength is that you can't get anywhere near him. You just get a flailing claw right in the lips, but that's not gonna be the case here. I should just be able to kind of alley-oop, and uh, no more claws. Yeah, I bet you that's delicious. Hold on, can we get the little guy off the back, please? Can, can you please just... There we go. You're free! You're... You're welcome. Whoa. Whoa, oh, I think he's taking that first file bar of heart. Oh, oh, no, no, stay back. Stay back. Stay back. <laughs> what, what, what much does it take? 
I'm boiling him alive. This is ridiculous. Go away. Go away. Ah, come on. What? Why would you die? Die. Oh, I think he died. Did he die? There's a little guy. Oh, wait. Yeah, there were parts over there. Kind of like a crab dab. <laughs> <laughs> okay, we're, we're done. We're done. There will never be anything better in Gorn than this. You know what? I think that's gonna be it for this episode of Gorn, guys. And I really only wanted to focus on one magic tome today. I, originally, I was gonna look at all of them, but as soon as I got into throwing fireballs, I realized that there is a whole lot I want to do with them. I want to use them in the arena. I want to use them against every champion, maybe even some challenges and stuff like that. So next episode, you guys have to leave in a comment. Let me know which tome do you want me to look at next? Water, earth, or air? And I'll probably get around to doing all of them. I thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you next time.